A federal judge has awarded a Lancaster couple $4 million after deputies shot them more than a dozen times. The man lost a leg. His pregnant wife was severely injured. KCAL 9's Juan Fernandez is live in Sherman Oaks, where he spoke with the couple and their attorney. Juan? That's right, Rick. This Lancaster couple says sheriff deputies violated their civil rights. A judge agreed, awarded them millions of dollars. Tonight, they tell us their story and how their family continues to recover. New life, huh? <laughs> in 2010, Angel and Jennifer Mendez fell on hard times. A house went into foreclosure. The owner never paid their rent. The couple ended up homeless, living in this wooden shack behind the home of a friend while they regrouped. Then on October 1st of that year, they say everything changed. I was sleeping. Me and my wife were sleeping. She's pregnant. It's hot. We're in there in the air conditioner, just relaxing. And uh, it just happened. What happened, they say, was two Lancaster sheriff deputies allegedly looking for a parolee fired on the couple. Jennifer was seven months pregnant at the time and was shot in the shoulder. They didn't say nothing. They just started shooting. We didn't deserve to get this done to us. In court papers, deputies claim Mendez pointed this rifle-style BB gun at them. Mendez says he was just trying to put the gun on the ground. In the end, Angel's injuries forced doctors to amputate his leg. The couple sued the department, and for the last three years, they battled it out in court. Just yesterday, a federal judge ruled in their favor, awarding the Lancaster couple $4 million, saying their constitutional rights to privacy were violated, and the shooting was an excessive use of force. And this case is a clear message to stop the brutality and, and really get on with treating all citizens with respect, whether they're homeless, impoverished, or living in a shack. I have a wonderful family, um, a wonderful husband, uh, and a wonderful life now. I mean, I can ask for more. The Mendez family now living in a Lancaster apartment with their three children. As for this lawsuit, the sheriff's department is not commenting and no word yet on whether or not they plan to appeal the judge's decision. In Sherman Oaks, I'm Juan Fernandez, KCAL 9 News.